sometimes. And to your point, he is doing it all. Ten points now, five assists, and four rebounds, right? Buchanan into the paint, comes up short. Riding with the steal, Usher takes it back, but that was the rebound and the steal. Now, Butler takes it strong to the rack, and a foul called down on the, the baseline. Right, and so that time you're a score. Right, you have an advantage, you're going down here, you go to a body, you get to the line. Not much to think about there. I'm thinking of uh, Donovan Mitchell, T, who in his fifth year last year continued to work on exactly that. How do you become a 20 plus point scorer? Because you dictate tempo, but also you attack, and the reward is right here, getting to the free throw line. It is, and it's timing and it's knowing in a certain part of the game, especially with Donovan, because you know if the shot clock's running down, they're going to put the ball in his hands. Uh, but that's what superstars do. They're able to score to all levels, and one of those levels is getting to the free throw line as well. And Sean Moran is very all the way up at that. He's sitting court side, in fact, just an arm's length away from Holly Rowe. There's Ja. And his next step of his game is maybe to stretch the floor a little bit more and be more accurate outside so he doesn't beat his body up with that athleticism going in the paint. Shot clock under 10. Usher bangs down low inside, has the ball knocked away, a little spin, beautiful shot. The bounce is up and in. Way to say one of the Jordan Usher's first who's played at Georgia Tech. Really nice two to the right after some dribbling, crap dribbling in the paint for Usher to knock that shot down. Butler, good hustle, knocked it away out of bounds. And Usher's another guard or, or slash forward that has some intrigue for the Jazz because, again, he, he fits that that mold of 6'7 and about 215. Athletic, fast, good defender. Whistle, and that's an offensive foul on Aldama. Can't say foul trouble, but he's he's been active in there all night long. Yeah, well, that was actually really great defense by Xavier Seed. He said one of his goals, as we see Butler with a nice three there. One of Xavier Seed's goals for this summer league was to show that he can be a wing defender with that size and length. And we have seen him really do a nice job on Zaire Williams today. He's limited Zaire very much offensively, and he just fought through that screen, got the offensive foul call. I love the intensity we see from Xavier Seed on defense. But Butler looking really comfortable in our guys. Especially from the three-point line. This game could be that launching pad into Las Vegas and to see him really continue to develop. Butler, by the way, eight of the last ten points scored for Utah. Yeah, it, it's no surprise. I mean, we, we, we knew he had it in him. This is a different environment and element for him to be playing with guys that he hasn't played in a long time with. The Buffalo takes it inside. Aldama got a piece. It goes out of bounds off Utah. 